Jira is one of the most popular project management tools used today. If you're a software developer, tester, product owner, project manager, there's a good chance you'll be using Jira in one way or another. If you have an interview coming up, it's important that you prepare properly for it. In this video today, we'll go over possible questions you may see in an interview and then appropriate answers for those questions. Let's get started. What is Jira and how is it used in the context of software testing? Jira is a popular project management initial tracking tool. In software testing, it helps QA teams manage and track issues, tasks, and projects throughout the development lifecycle. Explain the concept of an epic in Jira. An epic in Jira is a large body of work that can be broken down into smaller tasks. It represents a high level user story or a major feature that can span multiple sprints. Differentiate between a feature and a bug in Jira. A feature in Jira typically represents a new functionality or enhancement while a bug denotes an issue or an error in the existing code that needs to be fixed. What is the purpose of the Jira dashboard? The Jira dashboard is a customizable space that provides an overview of project progress, key metrics, and important information. It allows users to monitor and manage their work efficiently. Explain the relationship between story and epic in Jira. A story in Jira is a smaller unit of work that contributes to an epic. Stories are used to break down epics into manageable tasks that can be implemented in a single sprint. What is the difference between a Kanban board and a Scrum board in Jira? A Kanban board in Jira is used for visualizing work in progress and optimizing flow, while a Scrum board is designed for managing and tracking work during fixed length iterations or sprints in Scrum methodology. Quick break. If you're enjoying the video so far, please like and subscribe. If you need help on your software testing journey, check out my website, thetestinglead.com. Now, back to the video. How can you track the progress of an epic in Jira? The progress of an epic in Jira can be tracked by viewing the epic on an agile board where you can see associated stories and their status. The progress bar provides an overview of completed versus total work. Explain the significance of the backlog in Jira. The backlog in Jira is a list of all the work that needs to be prioritized and addressed in future sprints. It serves as a repository for user stories, bugs, and tasks that have not been scheduled yet. What is the purpose of the Sprint Report in Jira? The Sprint Report in Jira provides a summary of completed and incomplete work in a sprint. It includes information on completed and remaining issues, velocity, and other key metrics. How can you filter issues in Jira to create custom views? Issues in Jira can be filtered by using Jira Query Language, or JQL. Custom filters allow users to create specific views based on criteria such as issue type, status, or assignee. Explain the concept of resolution in Jira. 
Resolution in Jira represents the outcome of an issue, indicating whether it has been resolved, won't be fixed, or is unresolved. It's an important aspect of the issue lifecycle management. Explain the role of versions in Jira. Versions in Jira represent different releases or milestones of a project. They help in organizing and planning work by associating issues with specific versions, allowing teams to track progress across releases.